we're also going to add in technique. Sean's going to start us off, and I, I don't want you to watch the throw. I want you to watch the right foot and the glide and the smoothment. The smoothment. The smoothment. The smooth movement. <laughs> A little bit late, a little bit late, Justin, a little bit late. There you go. Yeah, that a boy. There we go. There we go. See that difference? That's a big difference right there. Okay. Hold it. Let's get to about 90 now. I'm away. Oh, meet up. Meet up. Nice pick. Ooh. Sorry about that. Cross. Left. Wow. Oh. Your knee was hurt. Yeah, it does. Yeah. Oh, you're waiting still. Come on. Come on. There you go. Come on, ready? Okay. Hey, see how you already hand forward? Yeah. That's because in your stance you're already tipping. You gotta be centered a little bit more. Not on your heels. All timing. Timing. Okay? It's just like kidding. Everything's about timing in this game. Right? When we all time we we get long. You go too late, we get late. Okay? Okay, so notice how Javi used used the term early and late, right? So this isn't as much about having super quick feet. You know, you guys do the agility ladders and jump rope, and, and those are things that are kind of God-given. Those are the talents that you're, you're kind of blessed with. You have, to have really, really quick feet. The difference between just hey, having really on. quick feet and being on time is your timing. You can have average feet, foot speed, in terms of how quick your feet, your feet can move. If you're on time, it don't matter, right? It don't matter. You can have really, really quick feet. I've, I've seen catchers that are really, really quick at their feet. Yeah, the quick feet helps them, but they're still not throwing a maximum efficiency. And that's what we want to do. We want to throw maximum efficiency. Jerky is not out of control. Control yourself. Get an angle to the ball. We're not going directly at it. We're getting a little bit of an angle. Slide, scoop it up, all in one motion, get rid of it. Give me a good feed. Good feed, knees. Oh, bad feed, plus five. So coming from coming from center, center right field, we've got these little guys. These are our little great hands trainer. Very difficult to feel. So here it's all about the feeling technique. It's all about being in a good athletic position and working low to high as that ball is coming in. So I'm gonna hit you like a two hopper. Alright? So there's gotta be we have to have a lot of concentration. How many of you guys played infield? Okay, we're gonna be able to tell who used to be an infielder and who and who hasn't had a lot of experience there. Right? I want, as you're working back with your feet, oh. your hands are low, your yeah. hips are down, and you're working eyes under the ball. We're always going to have our mask on, right? When we do this. We never want to flinch. We never want a helmet coming into us. All right? Our hips down, hands out in front, and we're working low to high. Two hands with everything. What we don't want to do is we don't want to go down, we don't want to go high to low. And we don't really want, we want to get away from getting down on our knee. We want, I want you to be athletic. Okay? Because there's, no, there's nothing you can do. And later on, Matt's going to slide the bag in. There's not a lot of places you can go if a guy comes on top of you, which isn't legal, but it sometimes happens. So let's make sure we don't get this pinned down. 
some emphasis here. Good working low to high, moving your feet, getting some glove extension, and keeping your eyes underneath the base. Okay? Four, four, four! Good roll. Good roll. Four, four, four! Yeah! Very nice, very nice. Four, four! Start low. Two hands, two hands. Two hand tag. Four, 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 four! Four! You're going to direct the direction you want him to go. Just too far left. Right two, right two, right two. Good, good, good. Just too far right. Left one, left one. Good, good. Now, we got him in line. Next responsibility is reading the ball flight. What's the ball doing? Is it dying? Is it getting to my cutoff guy? If it's dying and we say go, go, what's going to happen? It's going to take longer to get here. Good. 